Today is Sunday. I know it's Sunday. March 1st, because Batman's car is going to be here at 1 o'clock. No fear, I'm sure he's going to be here. It's 31 outside. The low is going to be 12. Oh, K and N, really? On a 3.0 six cylinder? Oh, it must be a fucking race truck, huh? Really? Really? Parental guidance. Anyway, this guy goes sit outside. Why do I collect these? I don't know. This is what I really wanted. I wanted this one. Shut your face garage. You'll probably chuckle, brah. Son of a fucking bitch. Are you kidding me? It'll tickle your innards. Son of a... What are you going to do? When they stick it to you. Let me see if this, uh... Danger Ranger is going to fire up. It's a fucking race truck, right? There you go, red and ready. Come on, you pig. Because there wasn't no oil in it. She so don't knock. The four-wheel drive does work. It's got a race muffler on it. Woo, dog is some bitch. This is some pimp daddy fucking ghetto list of shit, ain't it? Boom, boom, boom. Okay, got a question. Now I'm just guessing, and I don't know. But I know when I used to be in the mini truck and on Fords, in order to uh, get the front end to drop, they would just adjust the torsion bars. Now I had a 99 Ranger four wheel drive, and it, the tires always in the front toe out, the bottom toes out, cause shit gets wore out. This is an oddball, unless somebody got their fucking dick skinner in this son of a bitch. What does that tell me? That I'm fucked? Is that what that tells me? Or it doesn't tell me I can just uh, adjust the torsion bars out. It ain't, I ain't gonna do it anytime soon. Oh, really? There you go, son of a fucking really? But I knew that. Didn't look at that. Just so excited to get the truck. Some bitch. I'm assuming, and I don't know, and I'm probably fucked here. I would assume that's a torsion bar, and I don't see how that's gonna make those tires fix and I ain't trying to bring it to a front end alignment because I'm cheap bastard I'm thrifty so I'm thinking if I loosen up things up I don't know fuck it I ain't gonna do it anytime soon anyway because I got Batman's cars coming oh it's time to get paid time to get paid I'll show you Batman's car when it gets here uh, it's a 1970 Cutlass um, anybody's watched my channel, this is like two years ago. I did all the body work. It was rough. It, it, it is what it is. I put a lot of metal in it. I think I put more metal in it than what was there. But anyway, I ain't hating on this car. Because he's paying right, and I'll do right. Can't believe the man waited 16 months while I built this garage. In order for me to finish this car off. Why do you wait? I don't know. Tell me. Anyway, I'll show you when the car gets here. I think. Oh, I can't remember, man. It's been two years ago, but the passenger side is still in 180. Or it needs to be finesse on the doors. I 
think. I don't know. We'll find out. So we'll run 180, 240, 320, 400. Yeah. I don't know, man. I don't really like working out of people's cars. Um, but everybody got to eat. Got to more... Got to have money to buy more stretch bottles that get broken in the motherfucking mail. Anyway. Be happy, Shoe. You woke up. Yes, I did. It's a good day. Just like clockwork. Closed, bro. Oh, hey. Little sign. Did it didn't say March 1st on there? Look at this. I thought you smiled. I made you smile. <laughs> I was so excited, I was looking. Now I didn't even see it. Oh, please. It said, on the fact, I was saying it said it's March. March 1st. <laughs> excited? Oh, I know. You excited. Oh. You excited, bro. Um, you never excited. Unless you see some pussy. A hundred, that's what I get excited about. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> what are we doing? Little Art Earl Shies on this? Oh, fuck. Here we go. She's Here we go. Eat. She was going to talk some shit today. I'm glad you ain't got your new rims on. I really am. Because they'd be too big and it's just too hard to get the paint to roll up underneath. Because I was worried about that. It might Not that it matters. What happened here? Don't know. It is what it is. They said that your, your brother's house for a long time. Your brother Tommy. No, it did. Did it? Tommy up there. Oh, it was there for a while? Yeah, it was up there for a while. Y'all might as well sit back, get your favorite beverage, and maybe even a sandwich. I'll give you a quick overview of it. When I last worked on it, I need to wipe it down, wax and grease remover it. See what we got going on. A couple things have changed. He did pay me all in front, up front. To tell you the truth, they weren't hundreds, and I don't, I don't take anything but hundreds. That's just my only rule. I only deal with hundreds when I do cars, so I gave him his money back. He's gonna stop back tomorrow. Because what has changed? Um, this is what he wants. He wants me to repair that, dig the caulk out, um, and there was, where is it at? I don't know what happened here. It happened in storage. It's not really nothing major, but I know it wasn't like that. I remember the car. And now... Now, I don't know if we're going to do it. He's going to bring the bumper and everything over tomorrow. He wants me to custom build a front metal slash fiberglass spoiler on the front that he's seen on a model car. We'll see if that progresses. Who knows? Now, I'm going to wipe it down and see what we really got here. He does got some, uh, he has put some money into this car. Really? He didn't bring the hinges. But he's gonna bring it all tomorrow, I guess. Got a powder coat intake, carburetor. But the thing is, I don't see no antifreeze in here. When he tried to start it, that water pump did not turn. Um, I'm thinking there's water in there. I'm thinking 
I'm thinking, I'm glad it ain't my car because I'm not going to say. But when the water pump don't turn and it's been really, really cold, whatever. whatever. And I told him I need to bring some lug nuts because this is how he brought it over on the flatbed. I haven't even touched it. See the lug nuts? They're not the right ones. And I can't believe this rim didn't fall off because none of these lug nuts are right. That's why I put her up on the lift because I don't need that tire to fall off and the quarter, eat that quarter panel and I got to work on that. Did buy a steering wheel. Got the 442 on the head rest. Full leather, red interior. Turn some light on for you. New red headliner. He's got a bunch of aluminum inserts. And then he started making this, and I give him credit. Um, pretty crafty. Mark my words. And I don't even know this yet. Bet I finish it, this right here for more money, of course. And then I'll show you the color of the car. It was going to be red. He changed his mind. So be it. Not my car. And I don't really like silver. I do not like silver. Because honestly, if it would have been a high metallic silver, I would have said no, I don't want it. Because I model silver a lot. This is going to be the base of the car. It is called Shadow Gray Poly. And then we're going to put some stripes just on the hood. That is Cortez Silver. He bought the paint. So he got what? Five quarts of paint, a gallon of reducer. Probably ain't going to be enough reducer to put the stripes on. And he needs to go with some clear. I used to use Zoltone, but this is what I use now 4.2. Um, it works pretty good. It's by Gearhead Products. I would rather have Zoltone. But I have used that. And cut. And one last thing. Now he's got 24s for the rascal. And that little corner hits right there. Just a little, he says. That's not even counting the aluminum trim that goes around the wheel well. What can we do to fix it? Man, hopefully I can just roll that edge because if it comes the cutting and welding. You better pay, otherwise it ain't gonna happen. I'm just saying, time is money. Money is time. Um, yeah. The excitement is already wore the fuck off. I ain't even cleaned the car and I can tell I need to get my spray boot uh, peel coated because I'm only gonna sand so much on this and needs uh, another coat of primer of the whole thing. Yeah, pretty much, because, yeah, really? Got some new headlights, too. Some bitch, big ball of baby. Holy ranges, sitting outside. That 3.0, I drove that down the road. That thing is a pig, man. That's fucking slow. Am I going to do the best of my ability? Yeah. Yeah. Is it going to be better than any other car I painted? It should be. You know why? The more cars you do, the better you should get. Until you get to a point where you're the fucking man. Am I the fucking man? No. Am I ever gonna be the man? No. Man, I just, mmm. The excitement is wore the fuck off already. I can't believe those lug nuts, man. I just, them around. Wow, he's a lucky fella.